Good old Zabimvi. He's a guy you can count on. Well, we got him, Mason. Oh no, the blonde guy. Can't kill me. Oh, he'll be okay. He doesn't even have a bullet wound. You can't kill me. Thanks to your old man. Put it all on the line for me. For honor. Friendship. For glory. It's just like you, kid. Well. One down. Unknown more to go. I guess now we're playing as his son in the future. What kind of crazy guns can we equip ourselves with? Uh, I like this gun. It looks much cooler than the one we had before. And I'll put that on it. And I'll give it a millimeter scanner. Sounds interesting enough. Can I put two? Yes. Let's do that. What else? Okay, I can only have this thing. Wait, I might be able to have other ones. Let's go back. Nope. Switch weapons more kick quickly. Sure. No, we can have both. Okay. Hmm. And, and an EMP grenade, alright. Well, it looks like we got some actual, you know, new toys to play with. That's how it started. Your old man tries to kill Menendez. Menendez wants payback, even if it takes decades. Menendez, back then, was a, uh, a big fish in a small pond. He made his cake on the drug cartel out of Nicaragua. It was a hand-me-down. Mm -hmm. The CIA smoked his old man. Oh, Cyclops is pretty pissed at America. While we're fucking around the Middle East, the Russians and the Chinese are getting real cozy. Huh. Now, the politicians, they want you to think this is about ideology. It's a lot of horse shit. Give me your phone. <laughs> Go ahead. That's a non sequitur. Rare earth elements. Whole fucking world runs on this shit. Who controls all of it? China. So while corporate America is kissing China's ass. Now the mysterious court of Dia Social Network has crowdsourced simultaneous protests in both Iran and North Korea. Never seen in public, who really is the leader of Cordis Dia? He's known only as Odysseus. Odysseus? My ass. <laughs> Raul fucking Menendez. Asshole. I told JSOC, but they were too busy. See, the drone race had started. I mean, really, guys? You're gonna build an entire military based on a mineral element that's wholly controlled by China? I need a drink. Dipshit. No, God. Give me a soda. Get it from the nurse's stash. Not that diet crap. China's premier Chen is outraged by Cortez Diaz's leaked memo, alleging the cyber attack was covertly ordered by the White House. And through all the dirty shit the U.S. government's gotten away with, this time, they're innocent, and no one fucking believes them. They take out Cortez Diaz's network. Two days later, the director of the FBI burned alive. What the right fuck now, is with the burning? People believe that Raul Menendez is their savior. Shh. Guess what, boys? He's not. You better take him out pretty fucking quick. I bet if you... I bet if you swear some more, uh, we'll get the point. Oh, look at that. And then there's got a whole private fucking army hidden out there. It's gotta be Michael Shoot Rooker. This. 
Somebody look this up for me. State of the art tech. How many followers does Cortis D have right now? What, a billion people? <laughs> Try two billion. You'll never believe their leader's a terrorist. They think Menendez is their savior. They've got a hell of a disappointment coming. That's all I could say. Time to go see what Menendez has got hidden down there. I always remember, uh... Hey, Harper. Keep momentum on your swing! I don't want to be left hanging! What the hell? Oh man, in the future we have Spider-Man gloves! Oh man, I can't wait till 2025! A swing function. Okay. The surface is a little uneven. Jam hard with the nano gloves. So far so good. That's what they're called, the nano gloves. Ready? Okay, hot shot, your turn. But uh I really like Michael Rooker. He's actually one of my, my favorite actors. He's a pretty famous uh, actor. Let's go. And uh, I'll always remember him because he was in one of the first uh, serial killer movies I ever saw called uh, called Henry. And that's always what I'll, I'll remember him as. I'll always remember him as Henry. Where the hell did that guy come from? Okay. Thanks to you. Wide open. A little more than a skeleton crew. Walk in the park, baby. No seas idiota. Do not underestimate Raul Menendez. His followers sure did. And what does Cortes Dia mean exactly? It's Latin. Hard thing, some shit like that. Sounds like some noble. That's what Menendez wants his followers to believe. Trust me, it isn't. Cross we have wingsuits. Oh, my arm phased through his body. Well, at least uh, I can say the future looks pretty sweet. Woo! Batman! No, 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 Batman! What am I doing? Oops, I think I... Oh, oh, oh! Watch the trees! Yeah, thanks, Michael Rooker. We'll, we'll be okay. Right, man! Even if he's not, I'm still gonna call him that. Ah, ah! There! The gap in the mountain! Deploying shoot! Oh my god! Shit! Oh man, I gotta do this crap again. Use mouse look to steer. Hold shift. Oh, okay. Uh, oops. Alright, well now I got this. Uh, hopefully. Third time's a charm. That's why you shouldn't pilot wingsuits under the influence. All right, we got this. Uh, ow. Easy does it. Right, man. Ah. Uh, eh. There, the gap in the mountain. Deploying shoot. Deploy it. Deploying shoot. F Deploying F shoot. F. I think I got it. I'm good. Salazar, Crosby, you got the left side. Cover, ready on your go. You know, if I were playing this game three years ago, I'd say it looks really good. But after playing, four, after like playing Halo 4, uh, no. God, that game is so pretty. So pretty. Is he on fire? Morgan. This is Harper. Come in. Okay, no. 
Enemies preparing to leave location. Advise. We need firm intel on the capabilities. You are clear to engage. <clears throat> Excuse me, sorry about that. Section, you seen this? Yeah. Be ready to move on my kill. An EMP grenade will fry their cloaking systems. Okay. What the hell? We have grenade arm launchers. Also, pretty smooth cloaking devices. It's not like we can see your gun or anything. So what exactly does this... Targeting who's it, what's it do? Oh, oops, those are our own guys. What is the, uh... Oh, crap. Uh... What the hell? Okay, well... <laughs> I, I certainly didn't expect my little, uh, secondary gun to do that. Oh, crap. Gotta do this shit again? can't stand here. Well, I don't listen to conventional wisdom. Kinda like it though. Now that I know its capabilities. Oh, I can see through uh, rocks. So are we fighting Cubans right now? Since when did, like, Cubans get, like, this crazy state-of-the-art military? Alright, this time we will not blow ourselves up. Ooh, I want to see what the AN-94 looks like. They're not doing it right. They're not doing it right! The AN-94 has a, uh... System where it launches two bullets simultaneously. Making it one of, currently in this day and age, uh, one of the most advanced uh, rifles that exists, if not the most advanced. That head, drone taken off. We don't want that bastard airborne. Salazar, take it out. On it. Ow. Hack the weapon systems on that ground and burn. Oh, okay. Drone well. Down. Okay. Get these We're bastards get a taste of their own medicine. Well, that was convenient. Push forward. Don't let them if that grenade explodes me, will I die? Or near me, I will I die? Nope, I'll be fine. This sound, this this minigun sounds really pathetic. Ah, take that! Haha, -ha, I've destroyed your computer monitors! There's no going back now! Oh no, Cosby. Man, these cloaking uh, devices really suck. Is this guy an enemy? Yes, he is. gonna say like uh, I'm pretty is it oh, hold on I want to go back is this an exploding barrel yes it is I was gonna say maybe the major innovation of Call of Duty Black Ops 2 is that it might be the first first-person shooter to not include exploding barrels but nope they have exploding barrels but man 
if I still had my capture card, I would be doing a uh, let's play of Halo uh, Halo 4 right now. Because, God, that game is, is really, really freaking good. Oh, my God. Uh, it's automated. I didn't know that. In fact, I would say that it's better than it almost has a right to be. Ah, shit. Oh, crap. It came from behind. Here I was thinking we were just doing fine. And then this asshole comes out of nowhere and kills us. Thanks, Michael Rooker. And in the future, we have grenade arm launcher things. Hit him with an EMP section. What is uh, my grenade? My special grenade? I have no idea. I'm just going to hit random buttons until something happens. Knife. Oh, we have leaning back. That's nice. Well, screw it. I really, it's really tough for me to tell uh, which ones are our own guys, because sometimes they just pop up in unexpected places. So I think we're shooting Cubans. Uh, I'm not sure though. I don't know how Cubans got such advanced military weaponry, including cloaking devices. Because, you know, when you think of Cuba, you think of cloaking devices. Or, uh, am I supposed to open this, or are we supposed to wait for all these assholes to get here? There's gotta be more to this facility underground. Kraken, this is section. Surface installation is neutralized. Moving to investigate secondary structure. Everyone, clear! Will that do it? Yes, it will. But no, what I was thinking about Halo 4 is, it's like, at that game I think might be Watch better it. than it has any, any right to be. Because, honestly, I came into Halo 4, you know, expecting, okay, the story's was wrapped up, you know, what more are they going to do? They're just trying to extend it out for the fact that, oh, it's a Halo game and it's a money maker and it's going to be like a cash cow. But, uh, well, it oh, still is, shit. but they this. put a lot of effort into it. Top is just a front. Walls are several meters thick. We lose comms inside. Update Briggs. Tell them we're moving in. Dragon, this is Harper. Confirming SciTech installation beneath the temple. Requesting immediate cleanup and containment unit to our location. Be advised, we will lose comms as soon as we make our entry. Kraken confirms. Ground team moving for immediate insertion. Stand by for ETA. But yeah, and but yeah, they put a lot of effort into it. And Jesus Christ, is it pretty? That I think is definitely the prettiest game uh, to come out this year. Just from like an art standpoint just the weapons the the aliens the environments is just stunning stunning art design and uh well i'm not the biggest fan of the story Sorry, get it open it's still awesome and, you know it, it, it wasn't bungie that came in and made this game so i came in expecting okay they may have abandoned it as soon as we attacked you know, Microsoft is just making this game because they want to get a Halo game out. On me. You know, and this is an untested developer, but, uh... Oh, no! But yeah, no. 343 Studios, they really fucking brought it. And they, they brought, uh, their A-game. And uh, it could definitely be the best, uh, the best Halo game since the first one. You know, I think even maybe in art. Well, I'm not. I'm not done with it yet. Upstairs, go! 
But the argument could be made that it might be, be uh, the best Halo game of all time. But for me, it'll be tough to uh, beat the original. Because the original Halo, you see... Because uh, now I'm in rambling drunk mode, so I'm going to get like lots of like stories about my past. and uh, So here you go. But the original Halo was the first uh, game to make me become, I guess what you could say, uh, a console sort of bipartisan or whatever. Because uh, up to the point of, of that, I had only owned Nintendo systems. And I was like this rabid, rabid Nintendo fanboy. And I refuse to accept that anything could ever be as good as uh, as Nintendo. And you know, by the time I had a GameCube, which I still love, I still think you know the GameCube is such an underrated system, and they had such great games. Um, but no, Halo. Then uh, Halo came out, and I like kind of distanced myself at first, and then uh, my parents um, bought uh, me and my brother. An Xbox for Christmas one year. Uh, I think it was when I was in either just beginning high school or middle school, and uh, you know, played Halo uh, both one and two, and I was instantly hooked. Son of a bitch, ASD. Ah, well, fortunately, it didn't hit me at all. Man, I need a new gun. This thing's running out of ammo. Alright, sorry. Even though I really like that targeting thing that it has going on. I'm gonna try some of these other guns. Like, uh, this thing. Uh oh, someone is trying to message me. Who could it be? Actually, this is really a bad time to check. Uh. Filthy Cubans. Okay, we're clear. This is 3D fabrication tech. Weapons, components, armor. Menendez is arming himself for war. Well, Woods told us how much wealth Menendez built over the years. He's been investing in fuck? weapons tech. Somebody's here. Okay. What, what, what do we do with this thing? Oh, everybody's over here. You guys know you don't have to wait for me. Okay, come on out. This lab is linked to a known terrorist. You start talking, or I will hurt you. My name is Eric Breiner. I'm a magnetometrist. Yeah? And what is, uh, Menendez's interest in you, buddy? They brought me here to process the solarium. It's a new, rare earth element that will render all existing microchip technologies obsolete. They're coming. Get me out of here alive. I'll give you everything. I wonder if uh, Solarium was uh, developed by the uh, Solarians. Hey, hey, see what I did there? Just yeah. Uh, okay, I'll shut up. Why does this give me my exact same gun? Oh. Okay. Set down as cover.
Oh wait, that's a friendly robot thing. Was that guy wearing an Ushanka? No, he wasn't. It's like, oh, you're going to the Russians. Now there's like lots of anti-Chinese sentiment. They're finally adding in the anti-Chinese sentiment. I was wondering, when is it going to happen in Call of Duty? This way. The locking mechanism requires two operators. On your go. Oh, I got to do it? Why was me, man? Follow me. No. You don't tell me what to do. I'm a high-powered bro soldier. Quantum entanglement. This single device has more processing power than your entire military infrastructure. Cool. Rumors around the lab were that Menendez plans to use it as a basis for a massive cyber attack. I, I heard talk of something called Karma. It may be the, the name for the cyber weapon. If Menendez uses a solarium worm to initiate an attack, there will be nothing anyone can do to stop it. Oh no, they killed him! Oh no! And he was just gonna reveal an impl important plot point, too. We got incoming! Kraken! Harper requesting confirmation on extraction team's ETA! Defensive positions! Kraken, come in! Damn it, no response! We'll fight our way out, with or without support. This ain't over yet! Damn, here I was hoping it was over. Man, I love it when you can just stand in the middle of the room and kill three dudes without being hit. Oh, you st Your team can stand out. It's Briggs. Stand out. It's the extraction team. Boy, are you a sight for sore eyes? <laughs> for some reason, I don't trust these guys. I guess we can call this mission accomplished. Admiral Briggs, good to see you. You too, Sergeant. Whenever Menendez is planning, Solarium is the key to it. That guy's got a name tag. Admiral Briggs. He finally got one over on this cocksucker. He's just a man, Admiral. He'd like you to think he's something more. But he ain't nothing but a sad old pitiful excuse of a man. Thanks, Michael Rooker. When are we going to invent those ships? I'm waiting for the day where we invent those things. Like the XCOM, flying, who's it? I'll be right back. Okay, back. Uh, proceed. Our... Okay, we're old. Snake. Um... I'm really tempted to just go in with a double barrel shotgun. Uh, RPD... Pistols. It's Makarov. Recommended. You don't recommend shit to me. Oh. I'll oh, stick with the AK. Can't go wrong with an AK-47. So I've been told. Oh, 
can put an extended clip on my Makarov. Now I feel like a badass. Um, we don't need C4. I can't figure out the ninja is without getting inside his fucking head. Calm down. Salazar, you grew up in Nicaragua during his rise to power. You know his legends better than anyone. Tell me, why does he hate us so much? Because he hates our freedoms. He witnessed the country's rape and murder his people. In 1972, there was a colossal earthquake. His family lost everything. A year later, the only thing he ever loved, his sister Josefina, was crippled in a fire. Raul and his father started over, sold drugs for easy money. They became rich, powerful legends of Managua. The Menendez cartel was all but untouchable, so the CIA took on Raul's father in a U.S. sanctioned assassination. Right, so now Menendez fucking hated America and started running guns in Afghanistan for his own private army. The CIA got wind of it, went on the hunt for him in Kabul. That was the photo Wood showed us in the vault, remember? See that handsome bastard? That's me. The Obi Wan's your father. After Nam. The numbers and all that? I mean, he was one dangerous son of a bitch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 